Welcome back guys to another video. In this video, we are going to look at today's stock market action for August 6. We will be looking at Dow Jones, S&P 500, Nasdaq, their chart and how they behave today. And we will be looking at a couple of winners for the day and a couple of losers for the day. So let's get started. Before we move on, this is our website. Please check it out when you get a chance. This is all our social media sites. We are everywhere. So please check it out when you get a chance. We love to see you guys there. And please do not forget to subscribe to the channel. I'll be doing a lot more videos on this lines in coming days and weeks. As you see, indices had another good day today. The Dow Jones almost posted only 90 points gain. The S&P 500 posted almost 22 point gain. And the Nasdaq posted almost 110 point gain. Okay, you guys are looking at the weekly setting for Dow Jones index chart. I like the weekly settings because it reduces a lot of noise. As you see from this video, you can see that the chart like look a lot healthier. It took this uh, resistance line today and it's closed almost at the top end of the range. So the chart looks a lot healthier. So it's trading well over. It is a 50 week moving average and the 10 week moving average, which I follow. So hopefully this 10 week moving average will cross over the 50 week moving average sometime soon. The S&P 500 posted decent loss, uh, decent gains for the day. So it's also closer at the top end of the range. As of like now, the chart look a lot healthier. And the NASDAQ is the real winner. It's almost closed all time high over 11,000 points and 108. So it's uh, close to also at the higher end of the range. So as of now, this chart looks a lot healthier. And here is the quick look at the chart VIX. It's uh, like, you know, lost ground today as well. And it's closed well below its 50 week moving average line. So as of now, this chart looks really weak. I'm not sure that it's going to have any kind of firepower to counter this rally unless otherwise some breaking news comes up, which is really, really bad. So as of now, it looks really weak. So it may not have any firepower to now take out this current rally at this time. So let's get back to the website and we look at the Today's recap report, it is something a little bit interesting. Even though the indices rally today, our stock picks like now, it's evenly split. So our, uh, the losers now outnumbered the winners today. So it was kind of a little bit divergence, but uh, hopefully now it's not a big issue. Hopefully you know, this can catch up in a day or two. So as of now, well over 304 stocks posting anywhere between 5% to 1,472% again. So you guys can look at the link and check it out when you get a chance. And here are the few winners for the day and here are some few losers for the day. And if you look at the heat map, it's kind of evenly split at the time at this today, the red is like now outnumber the green. Uh, so let's see how things plays out in coming days. Uh, today winner is uh, Carvana. It is posting almost 200% gains and ever since it's added to the tracker on 413. And it's also offered a secondary entry point on June 8th around 109 to 114 price level. So let's look at this chart. So as you can see, it's added almost 28% gain or 30% gains today and it broke out rock solid volume and it's added to the tracker on 413 when it was trading around this range when it's regained its 10 week and 50 week moving average line and it's offered another entry point around here when it's found support at the 10 week moving average line. So as of now, this stock is well extended. So let's give some more time for the stock to now consolidate and you can enter if it holds up. So the next winner is PVG. It is uh, almost posted 25% gain and altogether since 721 it's posting over 31% gain. And uh, let's look at this chart. So it's added to the tracker when it's found support at its uh, 10 week moving average line. And today it's regained its 50 week moving average line and blasted out and it's posted almost 26% gain for the day. So as of now, this stock is well extended. So let it consolidate for a few more weeks like this, then probably it might offer another entry point. 
So what is the one liner? Leading growth stocks now added another round of gain like Apple, Facebook, Microsoft, uh, on and on. You can look at all the leading growth stocks. They added a lot of gains today as like the indices. So as of now, the rally look a lot, lot stronger. So let's see how things plays out in coming days and week. Um, that's all guys. Thank you for watching this video. Please check out our website. I will put this recap link in the description section so you can check it out whenever you want and please check out all our social media sites and please do not forget to subscribe to this channel i'll be doing a lot more videos on this lines in coming days and weeks thank you